Hi everybody, this is Joe with the Technology Closet and we're going to show you today uh, how to cut, copy, and paste in the Finder window files. Uh, right now I have, uh, I'm in my Documents folder and there's an untitled uh, text file in there, text document. Uh, what I want to try and do is open up or actually copy this and paste it. I want to put it in my Pictures folder. Okay, easiest way to do that is you can highlight on the on the uh, item, and you do uh, Command C is the keyboard shortcut to copy, and then you can come over to your pictures drive, and you can actually do Command V, and that'll actually put a copy of it there. Now to illustrate this, I'm actually going to I'm giving you a freebie here as well. Command N brings up a new Finder window, so we can look at this kind of side by side. Okay, so we'll bring it over so we can see kind of a small screen. But um, you can see that on in this uh, instance, I'm in my pictures drive, and there's the untitled folder. On this one, I'll go back to my documents, and it's actually still there. So all I did was I copied, made a copy of it, and pasted it into the pictures drive. What if I wanted to move this file from documents into the movies folder? Okay. You do the same procedure, highlight it in Finder, Command C, copies it. This time, when we go to the Movies folder, we're going to do Command Option V, and that puts it there. Okay. Now, if we come back up and we're in our Movies folder and we're still in our Pictures folder, we can see that. Let's open a new window, Command N, and we'll scoot it over just a little bit so you can see. It's a little bit much, but see if we can get it to all line it up here alright so there's movies and this is uh, this is going to be uh, our documents folder again it's gone from documents this time so command N opens a new window that's the freebie of the day uh, command C does the copy command V does the paste and if you want to move the file, which is more like cut and paste, you can do Command C to copy it again. And when you go to paste it, you do Command Option V, and that will actually cut it from the original location and put it in a new location. So that's your tip of the day. And I hope you keep watching and give us a thumbs up on YouTube uh, if you like our stuff. Thanks.